Under services of supply are the service commands, each an SOS in miniature, except for procurement and production functions. Continental United States is divided into nine such commands. Outside the United States, the Northwest Service Command has recently been established to service our troops in Northwest Canada and Alaska. Service commanders are housekeepers for the Army in the zone of the interior. They administer the Army exchanges, provide housing facilities for troops within their areas, as well as provide them with supplies and food. Keeping our fighting men fit is the responsibility of the Office of the Surgeon General. The personnel activities of the SOS are large scale and diverse. About 400,000 civilians a month are now being inducted into the armed forces through selective service. SOS has charge of induction and reception centers and supervises the classification, equipping, and processing of all recruits. A special services division rounds out Army life. The civilian employees in the War Department are the responsibility of the SOS Civilian Personnel Division. Because of Army contracts, the activities of this division are spread all over the country, geared to SOS's prime function, procurement. From American industry and American labor come the sinews of modern war. Steel armor, steel tanks, steel guns, steel and more steel to crush the enemy.